I was talking all kinds of crap about it, the puzzle being easy, and now we're screwed. What's this? It's a cage. Mama, why? What are you doing in here? Well, hello everybody, it's me, GSD Boxer, and I'm playing Lavender. This is a game by Clockwork Prince, and it's an alternate take on the classic fairy tale of Rapunzel. It's a short puzzle game with some horror elements. I don't think it's going to be as scary as uh, From Next Door, so let's get right into it. Before playing, please be aware that this game contains potentially disturbing content. For more details, please refer to the README. I looked at the README text. is nothing too, too big of a deal. Let's proceed with the game. Or first, uh, yeah, I'm using my controller. I think we're okay. If it already works with the controller, it should be alright. Show introduction. Once upon a time, there was a young woman, pregnant with her first child. She was very nurturing, and made sure to take good care of both herself and the unborn. One day, she was strolling through the forest. She had gotten lost and became rather hungry. Worried about her baby, the woman tried to find something to eat. Soon she found a cottage in the woods, with a modest garden next to it. There, several trees and shrubs bore delicious fruits. The woman let out a sigh of relief and walked up to the garden. There, she picked several fruits and started to eat. However, the owner of the garden was not happy with the young woman's indulgence. You see, the garden was grown with utmost care by the witch who lived in the cottage. She had witnessed everything through the window. Just when the expecting mother was about to eat a third fruit, the witch approached her with a cold expression. How dare you eat from my garden? How dare you eat from my garden? <laughs> That's the question. She snarled. Terrified, the trespasser vehemently apologized. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But it was too late. To make up for your grave mistake, I require tribute. The expecting mother bowed her head. I, I, I don't have anything of value. I'm afraid. I'm afraid. The witch pondered for a minute, then replied, Your baby. That will suffice. Wait, her baby? Yes. This witch was selfish and cruel. She acted in a way that can't be forgiven. But what happened to the baby? Well, Maybe I'll tell you about that some other time. I'm gonna call her right now. That that mother telling the story is the witch and the baby is the girl. Okay. Don't look so sour. It's your birthday. I guess. Oh, before I forget. Yeah, that's that's definitely a witch right there. How you be looking so lavish in this squalored ass room? Happy birthday, Lavender. Oh, it's so pretty. Thank you, mu thank you so much. I'll be sure to take good care of it. I'm glad you like it. Oh, look at the time. I'm sorry, Lavender, but I have to go now. It's okay. I had fun. All right. I'll see myself out then. That's a witch. I'll come by for lunch around two. Until then. Later, Mom. Why? It's such a nice day. <laughs> I called it. I knew it. And my present. Unless it's actually the mom, and she's locking her up before, so that the witch doesn't come and get her. I'm... we'll see. And my present? 
It would be a shame if I didn't use it. Ah. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I... I dropped it. Mom will kill me. I... have to get it back. So the original Rapunzel game was what? It was... Whoa, she walks super fast. Um... The original Rapunzel game... Or story, game... Uh, she... Was locked in the tower by the witch, right? So maybe this one is the mother locking her in the tower so the witch don't get her. Right? Let me inspect my surroundings. I'm not sleepy. I'd love to paint something. But now is not the time. No time to read right now. My room doesn't need to be cleaned. Where's that creak sound coming from? Whatever. The table's spotless. Huh? There's a long hair on the table. Obtain pink hair! Gross! There's no way I can leave the tower through the window. Unless I want to die a quick death, that is. Well, let's go down the stair- uh, Mom didn't lock the door? She usually does. Maybe I shouldn't... Maybe you should. Well, here goes. All right, this don't look as warm and inviting as that prison cell we were in. Nurture. It's a painting of a mother and child. Three cups. What am I supposed to do here? Plant shit? I, I did it. The flower needs a little more time to grow. What am I supposed to do here? What am I doing? One died. Uh-oh. Okay, so did I do this wrong? I'm just guessing. I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do. They're all nice flowers, I did it. I don't know what the hell I did. Oh, I guess I was supposed to unlock the door? The book on the table reads, Three flowers reaching to the sky. Oh, this would have helped me before. <laughs> one quite tall and brittle. One waiting with patience. And one quickly satisfied. Well, I, I did it by process of elimination. I, I'm just good like that. There's a long hair sticking out of the pot's dirt. Oh, gross, again. What about this one? Nothing left to it. All right. Let's go. Wait, is there anything else I should be checking around here? No. Okay. So a chessboard. I see boxes of books. Ch book bookshelves. There's a book about chess. The rook. Second smallest type of chess piece. Top part of the piece model after a castle's tower, and often have four or more merlons to help distinguish the piece. The rook can move horizontally and vertically in a straight line, and cross as many tiles as desired in the chosen direction in the same move. There's a book about chess. Queen, the second tallest type of chess piece. The top part of the piece is modeled like a crown with a tiny sphere on top. The queen can move horizontally, vertically, and diagonally in a straight line. And cross as many tiles as desired in the chosen direction in the same move. There's a book about chess. The basics of chess. The game of chess simulates a battlefield scenario where a battle takes place between two armies. Capturing pieces of the opposing color is done by moving to their current location. To distinguish the armies, each has its own associated color. Usually the two colors used are black and white. 
To win the game, a player must either capture the king piece of the opposing army, put the king in a position where it can't move, or stay in place without being in danger. The latter scenario is called checkmate. If the king is in direct danger, but can still get out of trouble, the scenario is referred to as check instead. I thought it was the queen. Think about chess, chess puzzles. Using the movement rules and general game flow of a ch game of chess. Various puzzles have been designed, both as a way to hone one's skills and to pass time. Unlike a game of chess, however, they usually do not require a second player. A common puzzle is putting down certain pieces to cause a checkmate, which is more like a traditional game of chess. Other puzzles require the player to put down certain pieces in a way that would make it impossible for any piece to directly capture another. And this is Bastion. It's a painting of a tower. It's our tower, I assume. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Read the book this time. The book on the table reads, Black searches for white. Were black to move, they would close in. White hides away for safety. Were white to move, they would certainly fall. Uh, let's do it. I'm a little confused. What am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to... This piece is nailed to the board and won't budge. This is the king? And I have a pawn, and... I guess I'm supposed to put... Let's just do this. I don't know what am I supposed to put. What am I supposed to put this? I guess this? Put that there. Can't move this. I can't put... Oh! Okay. Am I supposed to... Spiel nailed to the board. Am I supposed to... Spiel nailed to the board won't budge. Oh my god! It's like process of elimination for me. I suck at chess. I am horrible at chess, and I just went through for a little, little wait, way too long on this puzzle. But it's okay. Is there a hair on the board? It's a chessboard with four pieces on it. There's nothing left to do with it. No, there's a hair upstairs, right? There's got to be a hair somewhere around here. We read this already. That's not another pawn or a king. Oh, that's not another pawn. I read that. I read that weird. Uh, the king. This chess piece is the largest type of piece in any chess set. The top part of the piece is usually modeled like a crown with a cross on top. King can move always, but may only go to tiles adjacent to the currently occupied tile per move. What? There's a long hair tucked between the pages. Got it! I knew there was a hair around here somewhere. Right. Let's, uh, let's go down. More puzzlers. Plea. It's a painting of two women, one begging the other. I guess that's the witch. The book on the table reads, When harmony is broken, and interests collide, the slightest imbalance will tip the scale. The slightest imbalance will tip the scale? They gotta be... Oh, they have to be equal. We got a fat rabbit. So we'll put one of you here. Fat rabbit, you go over. Here. And then... Doggo, you go here. Fat squirrel, you go over here. It's pretty equal. Light cat, you go over here. Nope, that sucks. We'll put Fat Rabbit back over there, because Fat Rabbit is a little light. There we go. That was easy! <laughs> that was really easy. Fat Rabbit, good on you. There's a pair of scales on the table with the animal figurines on them. What? Another gross pink hair? There's a long hair draped over the scales. Gross pink hair. Do I have- Oh! Lavender age 12, HP 10. Items. Pink hair, pink hair, pink hair. Got them all from... Where we needed to get them. Uh, storybook? Oh, we could see if I just... Good thing I did that, didn't, isn't it? Okay. Continue with the journey. 
Uh, what is this? I just recess the room. I can push? I'm good at puzzles like this, man. Don't worry about it. Temptation. It's a painting of an idyllic garden. It's where my mom went and ate the damn fruit. The book on the table reads, A greedy hand moves forward. A target marked for grabs. A rope brings back the cornered. And the watchful eye observes. The watchful eye? Who watching me? Well, we're gonna push you there, there, there. You, you, you. Uh, you. And I'm gonna go here, here. This was easy. This was real easy. Come on now. Come on. Give me in. Did it. Give me the pink hair. The pedal still is fixed in place and won't move them anymore. There's nothing left to do with it. No, no, there's a pink hair somewhere around here, I know it. You gotta give me the pink hair. It's on the rope? There's a long hair wrapped around the rope. Pink hair, got it. Got it. Alright. Uh-oh. Wait. Commitment. It's a painting of a wedding. This is new. The book on the table reads... A bond for forever. Sealed with golden rings. These hearts join together. Their fingers now bound. Uh, what? I guess we're supposed to do stuff like this? We, what? Here. Piece doesn't fit. Oh. Okay, I get it. Uh, so let's see here. You fit in here. We need you over here. We need uh, one of you. I guess I can't turn him around. This doesn't make sense. I, I screwed up. I, I messed up. Unless this can go in that air. Right there. Right there. Yeah, I didn't screw up. Uh, we need uh, a finger monstrosity over here. Another finger monstrosity over here. One you over here. Uh, what? Am I missing something here? Whatever, we're going to do... You? And we're gonna do you? Right there? Mm-hmm. Oh, we need one pointing up. You. Over here. I don't know if I'm doing this right, but I am assuming that I am. You there. Uh, obviously, you right here. Because I got to point up to that one. They're all connecting. They all need to connect. This is the only one I fucked up on. That piece doesn't fit. I messed up. I needed that one. Can I... Can I grab it? Oh, thank you. Right there. And you right there. I did pretty well with this, considering that I'm just... assuming they should go to wherever they need to go. Uh, I killed this puzzle. Let... Let it be known that I am a puzzle master. Easy! Give me the hair. It's a table with a weird contraption on top. There are several incomplete rings inside. What? There's a gross hair inside the rings. Yep. Commitment. Let me go back all the way up to the top. Cause I don't know if I'm missing any secretnessnessness as I keep going down. I don't think I am. But I just want to be sure that I'm not missing anything. Hey, we came back. No time to read that now. No, no, no. It's that sound. What, what is it over here? Whatever. Alright, on to the next one. Oh, it's future. It's a painting of a pregnant woman. And a cauldron. And a book. There's a book about potion ingredients. Gross. Earwig. A tiny insect. Eye. A human eye. 
durian, a disgusting fruit that smells. I I hate durian. I really don't like durian. I have a lot of friends that love durian. I think it's gross. Bearded t or beard tongue? A tube-shaped flower. Bear claw. My favorite donut. Not really. A bear's most useful tool. Chicken egg. A common food ingredient. There's several common ingredients listed on the page. I don't think a bear claw is a common ingredient. The book on the table reads, an embryo is forming. A flower blooms inside. Two insects crawling over. The fruit of life that grows. Now these eyes will open. Each limb grows one sharp blade. When these all mix together, they're finally complete. Uh, that sounds like a recipe to me. Let me, let me get this. Hold on. So we need one egg. Let me, let me write this out. Okay, I think I, I got the recipe for something, I don't know, weird going on here. So we got, let's see here. We got one egg, one flower, two bugs, one fruit, two eyes, because it says eyes. And then each limb grows one sharp blade. So it's either one claw, one one talon, or because it has four limbs, four claws. We'll find out in a second. Uh, let me say that. Damn right. What is this? There are various items scattered on top of the table. Huh? There's a long hair among the potion ingredients. I got it. It's gross. I guess you don't need to solve the puzzle to get it? I thought you did. So, one egg. Black. One flower. Look. Two buggos. No! No, I'm coming to join you. And two eyes. Oh, sorry. One fruit. I'm doing it in the order it came in. Two eyes. And one claw. Mixed that. Failure! So it's four claws. So one egg. A flower. Two bug lugs. One fruit. Two eyeballs. And four claws. Two. Three. And four. Mix that. What? Oh! Ha ha ha! Yeah! There you go. Just follow the recipe, even as confusing as it is. The cauldron's cold content smell bitter, yet sweet. There's nothing left to do with it. Uh, let's save this, just in case. Save it on this one. Let's go. I got the hair already. Great. What this? Uh... The book on the table reads... Three hearts have gathered. One hidden, one brave. They both feel desire. The third, unaware. Beginning. It's a painting of three plants sprouting. Is that, like, me starting the puzzle, or the beginning of my family's shit in this tower? That looks like me. That looks like mama. Maybe that's papa. Tree, you go. There's a sculpture of a tree here. It's too heavy to move. Oh, crap. Uh, oh, I know. I, I fixed it. So we can do... This? I don't know what the hell this is all about. We're gonna do it. I think you're just gonna go here. Who knows? I don't even know what the hell I'm doing right now. Just guessing. No, clearly not the puzzle. Clearly not the answer. What about this? 
and no so pop over here I messed it up oh no we can do this clearly she needs to be under the tree little old, little old me let's do this here we'll do this here you here Switch it up. Come on, man. Mama, you go over by the tree? For reals? What the hell is this puzzle? <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> Whatever. Pale still is fixed in place and won't move anymore. It's a statue of a young woman, probably about 20 years old. There's nothing left to do with it. The pedestal is fixed in place and won't move anymore. It's a statue of a young man. There's nothing left to do with it. The pedestal is fixed in place and won't move anymore. It's a statue of a young woman. Somehow, this statue looks really familiar. There's nothing left to do with it. I need the hair! Sculpture of a tree here. There are several nails driven into the trunk. Attach the pink hair to the nails? Secret? What? Well, uh, huh. Same date. We can either go here, or we can go down here. So let's first save two files, because I don't know if you're going to erase my file. Who kn whoever knows. Let's go through here. Finally, we reached outside. Uh, give me my comb. It's so nice out here. Uh-oh. Trouble. Lavender! What are you doing here? I, I I'm sorry. I dropped my new comb out of the window. I... I want to retrieve it before you'd get back. Is that so? Oh, Lavender. Mama! It's okay. I'm not mad. I'm sorry. Don't be. I was just surprised, that's all. We should just get back inside, okay? Okay. I brought lunch. Ah, thank you. Mama? The end? How is this a horrifying game? I don't see any horror elements in this. That was an alright ending, from, from what I could tell. Uh... Kevin McLeod... Cartoon presence of music, freesounds.org. Drip drops. Bleat. Yeah, I played video games. RPG Maker 2003. Thank you for playing. Ha <laughs> ha, thank you. We gotta go through that door. Recall. I guess we can go to either one. We'll go through this one. Uh, what's going on here? Why is the... Uh-oh. The door doesn't want to open anymore. What happened? There's like a spider web and spider in the corner over there. What's going on here? There's more to this game than there was before. I was talking all kinds of crap about it. The puzzle being easy, and now we're screwed. What's this? It's a cage. Mama, why? What are you doing in here? Who's this? Present. It's a painting of a bald woman holding a baby. A bald woman? Why does the woman look like she has a mustache? Huh? There's a silver key on the table. Obtain the silver key. Silver bubble. Uh oh. Uh oh. 
Let's take it and go back. Let's take it and go back. We were in trouble. Mama, I didn't mean to hurt you. Didn't mean to make you cry. Mama. Oh man, life has just begun. And now I've gone and thrown it all away. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, well, let me take a look at the item. Uh, no description, but we can open the door. Use a silver key. Uh huh. No. You have nothing to say about this? What are- what is this? Are these people? There are people in there. Why are you saying nothing about the people in there? You're okay with this? Looks like a diary. It reads, I couldn't do it. Even if they're not viable, they look too much like her. I just couldn't. And Lavender? She must never know what I did. What did you do? Why? Why? We're in trouble. The door's locked and... Bad stuff. Bad, bad stuff. Are you br Ooh. What? What is this? This is... Mom? So it came to this. Mom, I... I don't understand. Why? Why this? I don't expect you to understand. Understand what? What is happening here? I'm sorry, Lavender. I don't think we will have any more birthdays together. That sounds like a stab. What? Why did you do that? Why, why? Secret ending. What? No? What? Okay. Yeah. What? Please input the gray painting's name. Oh, sh shit. What was the name of the gray painting? I gotta go back. No, it was wrong. Recall. What is the painting's name? Present. Ah. Painting's name is present. Present. Okay. Hey. Password accepted. What do we get? What is this? Oh, it's a dev room. Well, howdy, everybody. Howdy. Oh. That's cool and all. I'm gonna look at this stuff uh, by my own. On my own. Jeez. But, thank you all for joining me. This was an interesting game. It was quick, simple, even though it took me like 50 minutes. Wow, time flew by. <laughs> but, let me know what you thought of the game. I enjoyed it and I hope you did too. So, thank you. Thank you everybody for joining me and I'll be back again with some more indie game goodness.